Anyway, I'm rolling. Oh, you already got soundtrack? I did, yeah. It's already done. Kara, you've known Rob for quite a while, and how did you get involved in his film project? Um, Rob Hayden sent me an email several years ago. I knew that he had acquired this property, the, the ability to work on ecstasy, and so he eventually sent me a script, and he said, take a look and let me know what character you gravitate towards. I think he wanted me to read Woodsy, but I went for Allie. And um, I never questioned it after that. I was absolutely sure. And from the moment that I did and he said, okay, some little part of me started to slowly turn into him. So it's been a little process going on. That um, for, I'd say, two years ago we were about to shoot and then we sort of reconfigured some things. And, um, but Ali's sort of been living there the whole time, kind of putting himself together. So you feel that you can really relate to the character then? I do. I think that the thing that attracted me to Ali is that he's a character who's both been, he's a schemey who is now in the sort of gentrified version of Leith, you know, with organic cafes and the fair trade, this and that. But he really does have a foot in both worlds. And in my real life, I was always a part of the club scene and I had a band and a record label and uh, always in that part of the underground, you know, staying up until four or five in the morning and all of that. But I would wake up and I would preach about macrobiotic food and diet and balanced and local produce and, and all that kind of stuff. So I don't really know what kind of a person that is, but it's what Ali is and I could totally relate to it. 